Greetings and salutations all, my name is SS Spectrum and I'd like to welcome you back to another episode of Duskers. So we finally accepted the fact that we'd probably never be able to save all the drone boys, so we're just going to do our best in collecting as many corrupted communication files as possible. Let's jump in. Alright, so, who are our new drone boys? We got Nathan, and Kelly, Keely, Kelly, we're gonna say Kelly. Alright, motion, gather, ooh, we got a stealth, okay, let's pop stealth off of him, and motion off you, grab stealth, Grab motion. Alright, I like the look of that. Alright, we're starting off with a volatile ship with a type 2 infestation. Oh joy. Let's board. No uncorrupted communications found. Pop some motion. All right, looking good. Ooh. Nathan is the chosen one. He sees the matrix code. Uh, he also sees running into walls. All right, so let's nav two and three to R2. I'll hit generator and motion. Oh dear. Well, that is suboptimal. B21. Excuse me, Wally. Alright, we're looking at D11. Oh, it's Tim! Info. What do you got on you, Tim? A speed booster. Interesting. I think we go. Oh, no, 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 Tim. We need that stuff. But. We can probably. This out. Alright, so we'll gather all. We'll navigate three to power five. To nav three power one. Oh dear, motion. Nav three. R1, D14, D11, D14, is not responding. Oh god, it's the worst kind. Oh 
god, it's a swarm of skitters. No, you unstealth, Nathan! Nathan, no! <sighs> Rip Nathan. B14, B3. Good day, Nathan. What about go D7, D5? Can we get the baddies out of... Okay, D7. Nice. Alright, three. D19. We got some power up here. its way into there. Doesn't look like it. Let's see if we can get everybody out of. Nice. Thirteen. Swap. Grab that. 
No, take it. another wipe. Exit. Um, let's go to modifications. Only two scrap. Wait, we can repair Tim by t <laughs> Yeah, go Tim! <laughs> Add a rerun power. Rerun power actually doesn't help. Um, Q. Fuel Depot D. Alright, let's travel. And board. All right, let's hope for some communication logs. Hey, not a complete loss. Observation report. We're a little unsure how the rat got down there. Most probably an escapee from the labs. Decomposition is isolated to the lower abdomen, but is inconsistent with the rest of the remains. A seemingly foreign, viscous material covering what may wound. Inconsistent decomposition, comparable to theoretical discussion in Grey Goo Theory Index. There have been some concerns regarding the molecular assemblers that aboard the vessel, and with the rate of decomposition being so peculiar, I recommend an immediate report be sent to Leyland Corp. Something isn't right. I fear. Then we need to do something relevant to Grey Goo due to mention of Leyland and assemblers. Submitted as supplemental, unable to determine further course of action and communication. <laughs> so, what? You can't gather, so I guess we just exit now. No point in running Tim around just to die. Alright, let's hop up to quickly. Uh, class Private A. Well, we can hope that this will have some interesting communication things. Board. Alright, we got another communication. Number two. I just realized I should probably order these messages. It's unlikely they'll be found in a lot of course to intercept. If anyone is out there, a steady course, but it's tough with these ships drifting. Captain Jean Vogue. I hope... Oh, oh yeah, but I can't... I was gonna say, maybe I could get to that... that drone boy, but he's locked in a room, and I've got no ability to get power to him, so... Exit we do! What's that P? Yeah, that's an auto trade. And that's of no use to me. There's no real use in jumping around without any drone boys, so... So it's time to initiate another existential nightmare with... The Reset. What does it mean? What does it do? Will we ever find out? All these questions and more answered if I can ever keep a Goram squad of drones alive. Let's check our objectives. 
Alright, so. Yeah. Super Predator. And we've already got. Hmm, I don't think we've read this yet. Given the Fermi paradox and subsequent notion of a great filter being the reason we have not been contacted by a foreign intelligence, it is possible that the great filter is intelligent life. This intelligent life would be a higher intelligent life or a super predator civilization. This civilization's advances are far beyond any other and maintains the status by exterminating any intelligent civilizations once they attain a certain level of development. Okay. Hey now, I wanted to check out something else here. Alright, something else new. Yeah, nothing else new. Let's take a look at our drone boys. We got Matt, Ron, and Ian. Stealth gather generator motion tow. Well, that's looking good. But I think we will leave that for the next episode. So, my name is Lessa Spectrum, and if you're enjoying this series of trying to figure out what's going on in the universe while sacrificing countless drone boys to the varying swarms of Skitter boys, feel free to hit that subscribe button. It helps the channel out and will let you know when the next video goes live. That being said, I hope you have yourselves a great day and I will see you next time.